Well, this evening we have uh, issued a public warning. Um, we have essentially had a face-to-face -face conversation with uh, a Chad Weber, a 35-year-old man from Abbotsford who has some criminal pasts that include convictions for things like assault, drugs, and weapons. Um, we have received some credible information that he presently is at risk. Uh, we've told him as much. And uh, at this point, uh, we're trying to take that to the next level and let uh, the citizens of Abbotsford and elsewhere know that uh, we have that information and we are concerned. And that that concern extends to people that he might associate with, uh, people that could be in close physical proximity to him. And obviously, uh, if it's in and around him and, and people that he might associate with, it could be to places that he frequent or places that he stay. Presently, he's living in Abbotsford, and for that reason, uh, we feel that this uh, this step is necessary to ensure public safety. Is he? Does he have any gang links or gang ties? Yeah, in the ever-changing landscape of uh, of gang alliances, uh, associations, etc., I couldn't tell you presently what uh, alliance Mr. Weber has. What I can tell you is that uh, in his past, he has associated pe with people who were gang involved, and uh, and that is possibly part of the reason that uh, that he finds himself in the predicament he is in presently. Um, that said, it doesn't matter at this point. Uh, what matters is that we have received credible information that he is at risk, and as a result of that, and the fact that he is presently residing in our community, we want to inform uh, the general public so that they can make uh, decisions, hopefully wise and safe decisions, about who they want to interact with, uh, and who they want to uh, spend time with, and the places that they may want to frequent, and certainly uh, give some consideration to whether um, being in and around Mr. Weber at this point in time is a wise decision.